Welcome everybody, my name is Ola El Hosseini. In this tutorial, I am going to show you how to save the file as a template. If you always use the same layout or data in a, work in a workbook, the best way to save the file as a template. So you can create many more uh, workbook instead of uh, creating or starting from scratch. For instance, uh, um, I always use this design to create a service invoice. So the best way save this design as a template. So I can uh, create a new one from the template instead of starting from scratch. So let me show you how to save the file as a template. Okay. The first step. Click File tab, Save as, Browse, okay, from the Save as dialog box in the file name, type your file name. Okay, and from Save as type, select Excel template. Excel template, is, its extension is XLTX, okay? When we uh, choose Excel template, the location automatically changes to custom office template. This is the default location for the custom template. Don't change this uh, location, keep it, okay? Then press save. Now we save the file as a template. After you uh, save the file as a template, you have to close the template so you can create a new workbook based on this template. That's it. Now I am going to show you how to create a new file based on your own template. Let me show you how to do this. From file, okay, press new, okay, and in this area, okay, I select personal, okay, all your own template will be displayed under the personal tab, okay, select your template in this case i select surface invoice template okay excel automatically create a new workbook based on uh, a service invoice template okay now i am going to enter the information Okay, Okay, and now I am going to save the file, so I can press Ctrl S, okay, and specify the location, I can select from this list, or select the browse, okay, and give it a name for my uh, file. Okay, and I want uh, the type of the file to be Excel workbook, its extension is XLSX, and press C.
Okay, now the file saved as Excel workbook and its extension is XLSX. Okay. Now I am going to show you how to modify your own template. Okay. <clears throat> From file. Okay. Click open. Okay. And then browse. And select the document. Okay. Then there is a folder. It's called custom office template. Double click. Okay. In on, uh, in this folder or this folder contains all uh, your own template select the template which you want to modify it okay for example this one okay by the way the extension of the uh, template files is xltx make the, modifi uh, the modification you want okay For example, I want to change the style of the table. Okay. And then press save. Okay. And close the file. I press Ctrl W or Ctrl F4. Okay. If I create a new file based on this uh, template, the modification will be reflected okay let me show you how to do this i press file tab and new personal now i create a new file based on service invoice template and the uh, modification is displayed as we see okay Now I am going to show you how to delete your own template, okay, from the file explorer, okay, select document and the custom office template, okay, uh, in this folder, all your own template, select the template which you want to delete it, and press delete from the keyboard. Now you delete your own template. Now I am going to show you how to change the default location of your own template. Okay. You can press file tab. Options. Okay. And from the left pane, select save. Okay. And under default personal template location, specify your own. Okay. I want the default location to be uh, in a folder called my template on the C drive and press OK. OK. Now if I save the file as a template, file, save as, browse, and from uh, save as type, I select Excel template. Automatically, the location is changed to my template on the C drive. Okay. That's it. If you like the content, please like the video and subscribe to the channel. Uh, thanks for watching and see you in another tutorial.